the greatest player in Cleveland Browns franchise history who called Miles Garrett when he was the first overall selection yesterday. And a nice round of applause for the Hall of Famer, Jim Brown. To announce the Cleveland Browns selection, please welcome from Syracuse University, 1971 Hall of Fame inductee, fullback Jim Brown. Thank you. Thank you very much. With the 52nd pick in the 2017 NFL Draft, the Cleveland Browns select Deshaun Kaiser, quarterback, Notre Dame. Go. Fires downfield on time. Touchdown, Notre Dame. Deshaun Kaiser, quarterback, 5,809 career pass yards. An absolute masterpiece by Kaiser. Deshaun Kaiser. Prototypical size for a franchise quarterback, a little over 6'4", 233. He's got plus arm strength. The question are the pocket mechanics and decision making. Only 23 starts. I think he needs some more time before he's going to be ready. Now, at 233, this kid's athletic. See the athletic ability to score, the size, touch, back shoulder, well-placed. He can throw it. He's got a big arm. When he look at big hands for the pump fake and drop it in the bucket. So he's got all the physical traits. But that's what worries me right there. He climbed the pocket and easy interception return versus USC. I talked about the pocket mechanics and the decision making. In 23 starts, what I saw this year was that when the game got in the fourth quarter and the pressure got on, I thought he played his worst football because I think he was trying to do too much. What I'd like to see happen is hit no pressure. Now, they're going to expect him to come in and compete. He's second-round quarterback, and there's nobody sitting there demanding the job in Cleveland. But I'd love to see him have a chance to be in a really good quarterback room, take his time, and learn how to play this game. We thought for a minute there that the Browns might take a kid that grew up in Ohio with the first pick of the draft, and they decided not to take Mitchell Trubisky. Instead, they get another kid that grew up in Ohio with the 52nd pick. I think this is a heck of a value for the Browns. And we look for a comparison for Deshaun Kaiser at his best. I was at the game against the University of Texas. I left the stadium thinking, okay, this kid might be Carson Palmer. He's going to be a top five pick. He's a big, sturdy pocket passer. He carved up this Texas team. And also as a bonus, he's a much better athlete than Carson Palmer. So you've got the big time arm talent to go along with some athleticism. Mike was right. He did not play that well this year. But when you look at losing Will Fuller, you lose your starting left tackle, who's a first round pick last year. Your center is a high draft pick. That Notre Dame football team this year didn't surround him with very much. Well, if they had been picked, if we had done the drafting after the Texas game, he might have been the number one guy. He was that good that night, but that didn't continue all the way through. And when you take a look at what the Browns have done so far, guys, I think that they've done awfully well. And remember, Sashi Brown, their GM, said what? We're not going to force the quarterback pick. Well, guess what? They didn't make a move on this one. The pick came to them with Deshaun right. Kaiser. So here's the one thing I would say about Kaiser. I don't think that they'll force him into action early. What did Hugh Jackson say last year when they took Cody Kessler in the third round and everybody was shocked? Trust me. Well, guess what? Cody Kessler's got the keys to that car right now. Kaiser's going to have to work to beat him out. And the one thing you hear about Kaiser, does he love football? And will, uh, does he love what he gets out of football more than he loves playing it? Hugh Jackson will find that out in a hurry, so he better be ready to go.